Mac. Oh, Bernie Mac. Did anybody follow the Cat Williams thing? Like, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> God, that was a blast. <laughs> the best three hours of my life. And now on TikTok, my algorithm is so tweaked <laughs> to Cat Williams because I looked at every response and watched every clip like three times that now it's like all Cat Williams and monkeys in my TikTok feed. Baby so, monkeys specifically. So, so, so That's a, a very... really hilarious pairing i just want to point out no genuinely. it's yin and yang you know it, it is <laughs> just, just for, for background for anybody who wants to go down this rabbit hole because it is delightful um the the comedian cat williams who has had problems um and and but i used to very much enjoy his stand-up specials does it absolutely unhinged um uh podcast with a who is it with is it with shannon sharp right yeah, I think that's it. I yeah, yeah. It. Uh, I mean, it, all it, I see is um, Cat Williams in my head. <laughs> and and so and it's like it's like over three hours long, and it's it, Saturday Night Live even parodied it, and he like makes the most unhinged like declarations about all the people he's ever had beef with, and like just makes these like claims that are just provably false. That's the most unhinged, delightful, insane interview you'll ever watch. And then all these people like fact checked him on everything he said and it's and the problem is like if anybody else had done that kind of interview i i would have been like Ugh, gross but it is irresistible it's so good. like the like the extent to which cat williams is like i'm not getting up from this chair i'm not apologizing i'm just gonna go deeper <laughs> and deeper <laughs> and i think that's partially because like cat williams over the past couple of years has sort of been like a truth teller in certain areas about yeah. saying yeah. things like calling out dave Chappelle and some other oh, things yeah yeah and so I think people were like, oh, we don't expect this wildness from Cat Williams now, but here it is again. He's back. Right. <laughs> right. He's back. He's like, he'd had some like incident a number of years ago. I can't remember what it was when he's, when he was having some problems that was like seriously deranged. Um, but yeah, then he was like speaking truth to power and you're like, okay, maybe he's doing well. Okay. Again. And you see this interview and you're like, nope, this is, this is great. Um, uh but um yeah, sh yeah shannon sharp uh, was the one who who, who did the and interview you're talking about nfl the nfl shannon sharp yes and and, and that's it, even it more so hilarious funny. shannon sharp has a podcast watching yeah. him handle well, that sharp, was incredible yeah well okay well shannon sharp not only does he have a podcast he has a very successful espn show and he used to have a show with uh he was on um with uh, skip bayless on his uh um a fox sports show and then they had a very very bitter breakup and uh, now Shannon Sharp has um, a, um, a very popular like ESPN show, but um, apparently it's received 54 million views <laughs> so far. <laughs> oh and the God. last thing, I mean, the one thing I would say about it that was amazing about watching Shannon Sharp is like here, Cat Williams is essentially firing a, a machine gun over just over his shoulder and you can see him being like i am not moving into the target <laughs> like i have to figure out how to both like <laughs> keep my own integrity in the midst of this and not end up in the line of fire somehow either now or afterwards 